When Joe and I first started seeing each other, we were exactly on the same page. I mean, we wanted to live together, but we didn't want to get married because anyone that we ever knew who got married, it just ruined their relationship. They practically never had sex again. It's true. It's one of the secrets that they don't tell you. <laughs> I mean, I heard it from my girlfriends who have kids. Oh. My one girlfriend who has kids, you know, Alice. I mean, she would always complain about how her and Gary just never had sex anymore. She said that they were up all night, that they were both exhausted, and that the kids would just take every sexual impulse out of them. Joe and I used to talk about it all the time, and we would just say how, how lucky we were to have this wonderful relationship. We could go to Rome on a whim. We could have sex on the kitchen floor without little kids running in. And then one day, I was taking Alice's little girl um, out for the afternoon because I promised I would take her to the circus. We were in the cab playing I Spy. You know, I Spy a mailbox, I Spy a lamppost. And she looked out the window and she saw this man and this woman and their two little kids. And the man had one of the little girls on his shoulders. And she says, I spy family. And I started to cry. You know, I just, I just started crying. And I went home and I said, the thing is, Joe, is that we've never been to Rome uh, on a whim. In that kitchen floor? Not once. We talked about it for a long time. And I said, this is what I want. And he said, well, I don't. And I said, well, I guess, I guess it's over. And then he left. And that was it for him. That was the most he could give. And every time I think about it, I'm convinced more and more that I did the right thing.